What's up, y'all, little brother? What is good? It is. I don't know what day it is. I think we're nine days out. Yes, yeah, the third. We're nine days out. Um, I'm flying back to Reno today. It's like one o'clock right now, so I'm about to pack, go surfing for a little bit. Does surfing count as cardio? I don't know. I'm gonna make it count as cardio today. Fuck it, whatever. Um, but we're gonna pack first, then we'll hit that. Head to the airport right at four, at four four thirty. Get some food in before then, obviously. And we got an eight hour flight to Dallas. And then we got 13 hour layover in Dallas. So we'll probably leave, get some food, go to a gym out there. And then we have a three hour flight um, to back to Reno. So we'll get into Reno tomorrow night at like 9 p.m. Um, I'm no bullshit. Like, this is a 24 hour travel day. And it's, it was literally like the cheapest, shortest travel day available. I don't know. This is bullshit, but whatever. We leave in a couple hours, get back to Reno tomorrow. Um, we're gonna start doing daily videos, just like documenting this whole last week, last like nine days before prep. So videos every single day. So if y'all trying to fuck with that, I don't know, support your boy, drop a sub or something. Like it, comment it, feel me? But yeah, gonna make some daily videos. Uh, let me know if y'all wanna see anything, full day of eating, what my workout's looking like, posing routine. If y'all trying to see anything specific, let me know. Um, but yeah, gonna pack. We're gonna go surf. Then we probably gotta eat and head to the airport. So, um, can't really take the camera out in the water. Um, I got a GoPro. I'm borrowing my boy's GoPro, but I don't know how to download it onto my computer. So, it's not really working too well. I'm also not good at surfing, but we're getting the hang of it. Um, but yeah, man, that's what today's gonna look like. Not really working out today. I haven't taken a rest day in like probably like a month, month and a half. Uh, and my body's been aching a lot lately. So um, I think today's like a good day to just chill out, get some rest, go surfing for my cardio. Um, Cause we're still trying to lose a little bit more weight. Triceps aren't super striated yet. Glutes ain't striated yet. So we're getting there. Um, Yeah, we're getting there, but not where we want to be yet. So this last week, gonna push harder than ever. Try to get another like four or five percent better, so that when we step on stage, we just absolutely peeled. You know. But yeah, that's what today's gonna look like. Y'all know what an airport travel day look like: security, boarding, flight. It's probably gonna be delayed, and then to Dallas. But you know, I'll record a little bit, show y'all a little bit. Don't know when I'll see y'all, but I'ma see y'all, man. At the airport right now. Uh, I actually been here for like three, four hours already. Uh, yeah, like three hours. Um, obviously, flight got delayed. That always happens. You know, another crew member wasn't here, so we had to wait till they got here, like a replacement crew member or some bullshit. But we were supposed to take off, or we were supposed to board an hour and a half ago, and we just started boarding. And yeah, it's now 7.30, now we're gonna take off to Dallas, and I'm gonna just try to sleep the whole time, maybe watch a couple movies, I'm watching Without Remorse, the one with Michael B. Jordan right now, um, yeah, hopefully I'll just pass out the whole flight, and then wake up in Dallas, and then I think we're gonna go to Absolute Recon, because that gym looks fire, and I'm excited to go peep that, um, I don't think about it some more, I'm excited to go to Dallas, I ain't never been to Texas, um, I was looking at maps, like how far away the gyms are from the airport and shit, because I'm gonna have to Uber there. And all of them is just like keep saying like excessive heat warning. So we're gonna get our first taste of uh, Texas humidity. We've been in the South humidity. We've tasted Hawaii humidity. Now it's time to taste the Texas humidity. See what it is. But yeah, I'm excited. Gonna go hit legs at Absolute Recon tomorrow. And uh. Yeah, I mean, maybe just peep Texas for a little bit. I don't know. See how it is out there. So, but yeah, I'm gonna hop on this flight and pass out. So, next time I see y'all, I'm gonna be in Texas. Yo, what is good? It is 8 in the morning. Technically, it's 3 in the morning for me. That's a 5 hour time difference between Honolulu and Dallas. Um, but yeah, long ass flight. I had a window seat. 
As soon as I sat down, I passed out. I didn't even feel us take off or nothing. Yes, yeah, 8 in the morning here in Dallas. It's humid as a bitch already. I can already feel it. It's kind of nasty. I was hoping it wasn't going to be like this early in the morning, but right now we're waiting on the rail. I'm going to take that over to uh, like a train stop and take the train to a AR or Absolute Recomp. Do some cardio, get some workout in there. I don't know what the fuck my plan is going to be for the rest of the day. I think I'm going to hit some upper body and then just go, and then I'm going to just lock in and figure out my routine because I'm like, I'm eight days out and I still don't have a routine, so I got to get that shit unlocked. But, yeah, we'll see. I might just take the bus around for a little bit, go get some food, see the city a little bit. Who knows? But, uh, yeah. I might show y'all the train, but I also don't like pulling my shit out on the trains. Like, like in Atlanta, I never pull my shit out because, you know, I didn't want to get robbed. You feel me? But, uh, yeah. So, I'll probably just see y'all at, uh, Absolute, or AR, Absolute Recomp, whatever you want to call it, so. This is what we looking like right now. Got the fat ass backpack, duffel bag, trash bag, fanny pack. Just got off the train. Now we walk into the gym. I mean, if you seen me looking like this, you would never assume that I'm going to work out. I'm really just like hitchhiking to the gym right now. That's fucking wild. Who the fuck does that? I'm, I'm real life a bodybuilder nomad, bro. I'm just out here. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm just living, man. I'm having the time of my life doing it for no reason. <laughs> yeah, shit's funny. I don't know. It's like my own perception of myself is so skewered. Skewered? Skewered? It's fucked. That's what it is. But it's hilarious. I love it. This back day, but I definitely don't feel like talking. We're at absolute recomp. I ain't gonna say too much, let's just get to it. Posing right now. Already finished the workout. Damn, this is all terrible lighting. I got a big uh, forehead. Yeah, already finished all my, like, did back, a little bit of shoulders, some arms. Now we're posing. And this is what happens when I got some real lighting. Look, motherfucker, though. I'm an absolute fucking tank. That's what I am.
Finished up the workout, did the posing. Routine's starting to come together a little bit. Then we did 45 minutes of cardio. And we're now back to hitchhiking. We're walking to Chipotle, which is about, I don't know, 1.5 miles away or something. But it's a, it's a 40 minute walk. I don't got a car or nothing and the train don't go that way. So we're hitchhiking it. Um, it low key feel like my first days in Hawaii, just walking around with bags over my shoulder and shit. But yeah, hitchhiking at Chipotle right now. There's a coffee shop over there as well, so we're probably gonna sit down, edit some of this shit up, clear some space on my camera. Great workout today. It's, it's wild how important your environment is. I mean, I, I've been at 24 hour fitness in Hawaii the last like month and a half, two months, and I've just hated it every day. Shitty equipment, surrounded by a fuck ton of people, and it's just a shitty environment, shitty energy. But then I worked out at Absolute Recomp today, AR, and that shit was amazing. It was beautiful equipment. I was feeling myself. It had great lighting. It was made for bodybuilders. Oh, I, yeah, man. I just had so much better of a workout there than I do at 24 Hour Fitness. But I don't know. Maybe that's a little hint. Maybe that's a little insight into the future. I don't know. But, yeah, man, tap back in with y'all when I'm at Chipotle. So I'll see y'all there.